Hello friends, introducing to you the brand new Firenzato F4 filter grinder. As the name aptly says, it is designed for filter purpose. A very efficient grinder, easy to use. There's three memory settings where you can set the timer. And of course, first thing we do is uh, to replace the hopper with a blowout bellow. This one will significantly reduce the retention. This is a stepless grinder, but it's very sturdy. There is no accidental movement that you can do to it, the grind setting. Before I did this test, I have actually uh, removed the burr chamber and vacuumed everything inside there. So inside currently is uh, thoroughly clean. So I'm setting it up for a uh, filter coarseness. I put in a 14.2 gram. When it's about to finish, I think it's probably like a 10 seconds or so, you just have to pump up a few times. Now the wacker is pretty good, it actually clear up almost everything. Thirteen point nine gram out. So basically, there's approximately uh, 0 0.3 to 0 0.4 gram inside there if you're using the, the blowout bellow and whack it a bit. As you can see, actually, the grind size is actually very uniform. Guess who is doing the brewing? I assure you, it's not me. There you go. Now, if you do not have a budget of more than 13,000 ringgit to spend on a grinder just to brew filter coffee, this is a very good option. The Fiorenzato F4 filter costs less than 3,000 ringgit. Unless, of course, if you want to spend 13,000 over ringgit on a big EK43, and of course, you want to use it to grind a whole pack of coffee, then it would make sense. Now it let you let me tell you that uh, this Virenza F4 filter is not designed to grind one whole pack of coffee. Please do not do that. It is per shot per round. If you want to grind 20 gram, no issue. But please don't go and put 250 gram of coffee inside there. Alternately, what if you want to use it for other purpose? So here am I showing you what if I want to use this grinder to do espresso? It does allow you to grind very fine all the way until Turkish. But of course, when I say Turkish here on the dial, it's actually espresso. But if you want to go finer, you can. I'm making a double shot and I'm going to use 
the Lilith Bianca double boiler to brew this coffee, this espresso. Now be aware that uh, just now when I was using it for filter, I put in 14.2 uh, gram, it's come out to 13.8, so it's less than 0 0.4 gram stuck inside there. But when you are using espresso, the retention will be slightly higher even with the bellow. Not significantly very high compared to commercial espresso machine, espresso grinder, I mean. This one, this round, I put in 20 gram. And you shall see how much it comes out. Eighteen point five. So you know roughly when you're doing espresso, especially when it's so fine, there's a um, the ground will tend to stuck in all the crevices about 1.5 gram inside but once you blow up for the first time after after that if you are doing back to back you should get consistently uh, less than 0 0.2 gram left inside Do note that this grinder is using the high uniformity burr. Basically, it gives advantage for filter coffee. It still makes very good espresso, but when it comes to filter coffee, it is a different level of grade. 